Hello everyone, welcome to another video. My name is Crypto David and today we are talking about Hedera Hashgraph. A lot of interest news in today's video. Very informative. I have cherry picked the best information in the market just for you. So make sure to stick around to the end of the video to get the most value that you can possibly receive. Title of the video is how I plan to make $1 million with HBAR or even more for that matter. I got bullet points. I want to talk about the actual effect of compound investing, you know, whether you don't think you have that much money to invest in the market over a long period of time. You look back in a couple of years, you will be balling with different assets. I think I'm going to ball with HBAR. A lot of HBAR news I'm going to go over later in the video and Mark news also. So if it's your first time to the channel, please subscribe, leave a like down below. Without further ado, here we go. Okay, so below the thumbnail, we have compound investing number one. D say every week, $300 at six cents equals 4,900 HBAR. Now, obviously, I just put the random out here, $300. It's not how much you know, I'm decent every week. It changes all the time. This is the amount that we can base something off. Obviously, as well, at six cents, the price is going to change. In my opinion, I think these six cents, five cents sort of positions are the bottom for H bar, so obviously we'll have to, you know, half the amount at the end or whatever. So that equals 4,900 H bar. Now, if you did it from next week onwards until January 2025, 113 weeks, you would then have 553,700 H bar if you committed $300 worth and it somehow stayed at six cents. That's how much you would get, and you would be put in on the rich list at these higher positions at the swordfish sort of level. And by January 2025, your one or your 500,000 H bar amount will definitely be a lot higher on the rich list because one H bar will be a lot more expensive at that point. It won't be six cents anymore. It'll be hard to obtain. And the majority of people in these higher positions would have probably taken a lot of profit on the way and their bag size diluted heavily. So 500k would definitely be a lot higher on the ranks. Now, 553,700 H bar in dollars right now at time of recording, is $33,640. So in the crypto coin calculator, let's do price predictions for 2025 H bar. Let's go in the low end, just $2 per H bar. That's still giving you that $1 million profit sort of standpoint. Let's go for $3 per H bar. My price predictions is that $3 to $6 sort of range, 1.6. Let's go in the higher range here, $6 per H bar. That is giving you 3.2 mil. Okay, so this was just an example. And on the second glance, that's quite an aggressive DCA method, considering this is only one asset. If you're diversified over a lot of projects, you cannot probably spare 300 for one singular asset every single week. So let's, you know, let's cut in half $150 per H bar. So 553700 divided by two. I think two is fair enough. So 276,000. Let's adjust for the price of H bar going up. So let's divide that by two. Again, so 138,000 H bar. That is in dollars, $8,300 worth. So let's put it on the crypto coin calculator, $8,300 worth. Right, that same sort of amount of coins there. Expected price points for 2025. If you plan to take profit, $2 per H bar, that's giving you $266,000. Let's go and you know, double that, obviously, taking you to 540,000. $6 in the high end, that's giving you. $800,000, $814,000. This is obviously all speculation. Nothing in the future of cryptocurrency is guaranteed, but it allows you to have a little bit of vision. You'll put a plan in place, see what sort of steps you need to go to to reach these sort of amounts of profit, whether that be investing $100 or 200 or even $300 every single week with your crypto assets. And you never know, your plan might change along the way. You might not be as disciplined to DC every single week or your financial situation might change for the negative or for the positive, maybe you might start DCA more every single week. Who actually knows? Now, now I want to talk about the price of H bar. We're still sat at these six cent positions, and I'm pretty disappointed because I thought at least with the Coinbase listing, you know, I was stacking up quite a lot before that. We would have you know quite a decent plum in price action, a little bit of movement, but not even to these you know seven cent sort of positions. So you know it's okay for me. It allows me to continue my DCA method at these six cent sort of positions and stick to plan. Now, two videos ago, we talked about a new governing council member arriving. Last video, we alluded to who that might be, and here we have Nifty Invest. Google pits Coinbase to take cloud payments with crypto. HBAR gets listed to Coinbase. In a few days, Google Cloud provides infrastructure that Hedera needs to support the next generation of DLT. Could the next governing council member be 
Coinbase. Here you can stake your QNT on HBAR up 9% in the last 30 days. A high demand of QNT token is now incentivized on saucer swap. QNT HBAR yield farm is live now. So in this case, you have to stake the equal amount of both. And last time I checked the awards like HBAR slash QNT was 47%. And 60%. And I'm very tempted to do it, but I just don't know. I don't really trust these things 100%, so I'm probably going to stay back, to be honest. But let me know down below if you're doing it or if you can convince me to participate. Also, we have Tajuri here. Now, we talked about the DIFC launching Tajuri, the global digital vault. We can see here uh, your entire life admin. We've got your vault uh, through advanced cryptography, uh, biometric authentication. And this is all built on Hedera. Everything is currently being tokenized and data ownership is being built on Hedera. This is literally huge. There's another point I want to make later on in the video that the majority of use cases on Hedera will people be using Hedera without even actually knowing about it on the back end. Also, Coin98 Analytics ranking of active developer accounts. Now, if you look at the top 10 here, Hedera is top 7 out of these assets. It's very interesting to see because likes of Ethereum, Cardano, Polkadot, Cosmos, in terms of market cap, they're way ahead of Hedera while still being sent. And here we have Cupos, QPLES by Phobi goes live with a new affiliate marketing platform and announces first two commercial shopper bridge deals. Now this is another example where Hedera will not be known that it's actually involved because Hedera has set itself up or is setting itself up as a network that can plug into every sector. And on top of that, it is cheap and there is so many use cases and they're going to impact every single sector and that's why i'm so excited for the future of hedera hashgraph also we have here the hedera council nodes if you click on them you see white pro there you got zane over here you got standard bank over there now you can go to the transactions and see how many last 24 hours you know a lot of them at 22,000 ucl google 16,000. you can see further down here AB Dennison, 20,700. But the top one by a mile is LG at 165,400. And the difference between Hedera's nodes and everyone else's nodes is that they don't need the entire history of the ledger because consensus is reached every three to five seconds. So the entire history can be removed, gone, but still reach consensus. And the only thing it is limited by is the actual nodes upload and downloads speeds. Also, here we have Justin, UK inflation rate rises to 10.1% highest in 40 years. I'm telling you right now, whenever money hits my bank account, it goes straight into cryptocurrency, straight into towards the DCA, you know, the USDC bag towards the DCA. It's going to happen on every single Sunday, which I DCA in. That's what happens. And you'll see me over now. You know, I'm living below my means, but over time, you're going to see a new background get done, a new camera. I'm going to level up, level up, level up. And I hope you guys are leveling up with me. And so many people have it the wrong way around. They want instant gratification. They want that instant feeling, that end point, that get rich quick sort of scheme. But that's not the way it works in the majority of cases. And that's why I have to DSA every week over a long time so you can enjoy the fruits, enjoy the success in 2025 or whether a later year beyond that, 2027 or 2030, or maybe even a couple of years, depending on how much success you actually want. Also, before we close the video off, I want to make a little point here. On my TikTok last night, I asked a question, are you on the HBAR rich list? I showed you know, what sort of amounts you need to be at 1%, 10%, and so on. And here is XRP rich list. Now, this is what I find pretty interesting. Obviously, the HBAR rich list is unofficial. To be in the top 1% of XRP holders, you need 62,000 XRP, which is equivalent to $28,000 worth. $28,000 worth, around the same sort of statistics right now on the live chart. So $28,000 worth. Now in the HBAR top 1% positions, we can see here, the closest 1.29 is 1 million HBAR. And right now at time recording, that is $60,000. I know XRP to be one of the most popular cryptocurrencies, so buying this chart is easier to get in the top 1% of XRP than it is HBAR. It's probably a big reason why, though, is because XRP is deemed a security in the United States and the actual list of HBAR is unofficial. But that's going to be pretty much it for today's video. Please let me know down below what is your method? What is your goals? What is your do you DCA every single week? every month or do you just buy when you feel like it or buy whenever a lot of funds are coming in or are you waiting for lower prices than we are right now please let me know down below but made this fun the video thank you very very much for watching please leave a like down below and i'll definitely see you guys in the next one